uh, gold medal winners. Uh, tell us about that. Um, I don't really have that many words. Now I gotta go back and rewatch film, but you know, it's a great feeling, though, being able to do it on U.S. soil. You know, the crowd was electrifying before the race, during the race, after the race. They were going crazy. It was an amazing feeling. I enjoyed it. Um, I heard the crowd wholeheartedly on the whole home stretch, and I just knew I had to stay relaxed. I knew the other girls was coming, you know, we all have the same end goal of getting a gold medal and I just knew I had to finish on through the line. Uh, we saw what it meant to you at the end there, that just what, I guess, just that outpouring of emotion, yeah, just to win that gold. Yes, that was a very right emotion, you know, because I believe in us, I believe that we could do it, um, you know, and just being able, I felt that we won when I crossed the line, but just being able to see it on the scoreboard, the actual proof was amazing, you know. Congratulations. Um, you. Melissa, you, yeah. how has it felt uh, to keep this incredibly long season going? How have you kept going throughout all this? It's amazing. Uh, you know, I've kind of been like good race, bad. Well, not good race, okay race, good race, okay race. Kind of that pattern uh, for a little minute. And so, you know, going into the 100 meter finals, of course you want to go out there and compete to the best of your ability. And it's not that I was... I was upset to a certain extent because I knew that I was better than an eighth place finish. But um, to leave here with this right here it means the world, and I'm just excited to see what happens next. How are you guys gonna celebrate? Um, we don't know. You know, it's a long night. You know, it's kind of kind of tired night, so we're gonna see. <laughs> yeah. Time will tell. <laughs> One, two, three in the individual hundred. How do you guys assess your chances of beating them? Um, you know, like I told the other reporters, um, men and women relay, you can have the four fastest coming together, but if there's no chemistry, there's no trust, um, to be able to move the baton through the exchanges, then you aren't really going to produce what you think you can produce just because you have the three or four fastest women. So, you know, we just came in, we trust one another, um, our chemistry was there, it was just a matter of putting it all together on a track when it counted, and that's what we did, and we came out with the gold medal. So, 